Good afternoon and welcome back. Well, we do indeed have rain out there and it was just like this duck weather out there. Jim Whitfield shot this for us out of Huckleberry Park down there in Hannibal and uh, the weather went afoul today, folks. It really did. You know what I'm saying? We had the rain, we had the cold temperatures, the clouds, and I'll stop with all the bad puns now and just tell you the weather. It, uh, you know, it's been sort of a clammy kind of day, though. And we're going to see the chance for rain. Well, that's going to continue for the next few days. It's dark out there. Look at this shot here. Wow, it's sort of ominous here. We've got low clouds. Nothing severe, just some rain across the region and the cold temperatures as well. The clouds and the rain really hampered temperatures from warming up much. We're back up to close to 40 degrees. I uh, thought highest would be in the middle 40s today, but uh, in some locations we're at 40 right now. Jacksonville, Macomb, Pittsfield, and Kirksville. 30s elsewhere, though, and we're going to see temperatures actually start to warm a little bit overnight now as this rain starts to scamper out of town, at least the widespread heavy stuff. Temperatures right now near 40 degrees. Quincy, we're dry. Could have a little light rain falling, actually, but overall, it looks like we're spotty showers across much of the region right now over towards Beardstown. You had some good rains this afternoon. Back up towards Rushville and Astoria, some scattered light showers ongoing. The northern part of the viewing area here looks like east of Nauvoo, back over towards La Harp and east of Carthage, moving into parts of McDonough County and around Macomb, some rain showers as well. So that's going to be the pattern for the next several hours. Temperatures are about 5 degrees cooler than they were last night at this time. So uh, we're going to work on those temperatures and the wind chill values with the wind out there. It feels more like 30 degrees in Quincy. And it was just sort of a blustery kind of day out there with the raindrops flying around as well. Rain chances will continue through tonight on into tomorrow. Cloudy and cool weather on tap for the end of the work week. And then for the weekend, we're going to be chilling out. Arctic air is going to move down. We're going to see temperatures. Well, they're going to fall into the 20s for highs on Saturday and Sunday. Cloudy skies, 36 degrees right now. Feels more like 29 out at the airport with a southeast breeze at 9 miles an hour. Our high today, well... Not much of a high, 40 degrees, 9 degrees below average for this time of year. Our low, 36 degrees, 4 degrees above average, but nowhere near 8 degrees. The record for the date set back in 1914. 42 in Chicago, 39 in Bloomington, 55 though, a little more mild air down in Springfield. And we're going to tap into some more mild air coming up across the region. This first storm moving out of the area of rain back over northern sections of Illinois. Even some snow, look at that white stuff flying up there over Wisconsin. Back out to the west, though, plenty of clouds, more systems that are going to push through in advance of a cold front that will swing through later on Thursday night. Right now, clouds and showers moving generally south and east of the tri-states. We're going to keep the light rain chance, though, on through the evening hours. Put the maps into motion. Here's what the forecast in motion shows. More chances of rain as we go on through tonight into tomorrow. We'll see the chances increasing across the region, especially during the day tomorrow. Rain chances likely across Quincy and the tri-states. No real heavy downpours, but some moderate steady rain will be likely. This should be all out of here by later on Thursday night. Friday, we could still see a couple of the snowflakes mixing with a little light rain as we head through the day on Friday before things end altogether. Scattered rain, though, tonight. Cloudy skies, lows around 42 degrees after midnight. And once again, temperatures try to nudge up a little bit on through the overnight hours into the lower 50s. Tomorrow afternoon we go with rain likely. Keep those umbrellas handy. Winds out of the south, southeast. Your Illinois signal seven-day forecast will point to windy conditions and cold temperatures behind that front as Arctic high pressure builds down across the area. Sunny skies and a high of 28 degrees on Saturday. There's your 12 degrees, Ross, for Sunday morning with some sunshine on Sunday. We'll still see temperatures fighting hard to get up through the 20s, uh, going 28 right now for a high on Sunday. We warm it into the lower 40s by Monday. So the weather went afoul, huh? It sure did, man. <laughs> and so did my bad joke telling or well, hey, pun telling. If I you give will. you credit for trying. I did. I, it's think, a I, bad I day. think I succeeded. It yeah. was just bad. A gloomy day. You try to lighten it up. I, I appreciate it.